Police all over the world know that pictures like this are a deception. These are headlines we all know. The police have made another big bust and they're keen to show it off with the drugs laid out on the table and the cameras clicking. Senior police love this coverage. They get to bump up their statistics and push for bigger budgets. Politicians use it to convince everyone their policies are working. And journalists know that drug stories always generate clicks. <laughs> but there's a dirty secret that every cop in that picture knows. That no matter how impressive the seizures look, it makes absolutely no difference to the drug supply. Not only do we never decrease the drug supply, these busts actively increase violence. If you take out one major drug dealer, all you do is instigate a turf war. And in this war, it's the most violent and ruthless criminals who rise to the top. This is part of the reason why drug gangs now exploit children. Even the National Crime Agency, Britain's version of the FBI, recognised that this approach doesn't work. While there is a user base willing to spend millions and millions of pounds on drugs, we will have an issue with illicit drugs in this country. We can't arrest our way out of that. We need to tackle the drivers behind it. Wherever you see police post this kind of drugs photo op, please post this video in the comments so we can continue this discussion. If you're a police officer who, like me, realises that policing the war on drugs only makes the situation worse, then please get in touch. Join the growing international movement. Follow the Law Enforcement Action Partnership, Anyone's Child and Transform Drug Policy Foundation. Because drugs are a health issue, not a criminal one.